प्रणाम आचार्य जी फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई वॉन्ट टू एक्सप्रेस माई ग्रेटिट्यूड फॉर युअर प्रेजेंस एंड इट्स मोर ऑफ अ रिक्वेस्ट आर देन क्वेश्चन कैन यू प्लीज इंट्रोड्यूस टू अस सम टूल्स और प्रैक्टिस विच कैन हेल्प अस इन मेंटेनिंग एंड फोकसिंग आर अवेयरनेस ऑन द पाथ ऑफ दैट एंडलेस वर्क यू हिंटेड अबाउट द इन वर्क एक्चुअली all my life i have never really used any specific definite tool but since you have asked for it the one that i can recommend especially to a young person is the question what is going on and to whom things always happen to you when you are awake alive and conscious right there is always something happening you are constantly in the middle of experiences are you not right always keep asking what really is happening and who is experiencing it that's all and this has to be 24 hour practice this is not something that you can practice only when you are down or defeated in fact far greater importance is to ah is of asking these questions when you are happy and high what's happening what's happening what's happening out there what's happening in here i'm in the middle of a market what really is a market can i define a market what is a market and bring the whole definition down to first principles hmm so fine a market is a place where a seller meets a buyer right who is the seller and why does he want to sell what is he selling who is the buyer why why and what does he buy what is this interaction like don't believe the pre existing definitions you carry in your head always reduce everything to first principles what really is going on hmm so you 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 know right I mean, there are two kinds of people one who just work on formulae so you can mug up the formula and try to plug in values and try to solve problems that usually does not get you through the je and then there is the other kind of mind that operates from the first principles hmm cultivate that mind always go to the first principles hmm so there is that woman i am feeling attracted to what is this thing called attraction what really is happening could i have experienced this attraction when i was asleep so what happens when i wake up all right i saw her i saw her and then there is something called attractiveness can i define attractiveness indulge in all these things i mean it might spoil the romantic uh, fervor of the evening but but would help you a lot hmm? right i am afraid what is this thing called fear what is my fear saying to me fear is threatening me what is the threat all about and if you can understand what fear is saying to you you will have to answer and you will be in a position to answer who is the one being threatened hmm? have very very curious eyes very investigative eyes don't just trust what you already know what you already know might be of value and might be of no value at all it might actually be a big impediment in the way of understanding apply the basics what's the harm in asking a question if your pre existing answer is all right then the question and the associated scrutiny will only reinforce your confidence in your pre existing answer no harm done right but suppose for a moment that your pre existing answers are hollow 
or even junk then that scrutiny can help you so much right and that attitude of inquiry must not be reserved only to an academic subject when one becomes an enquirer in life then life itself shines beautifully all that which is not worth keeping simply drops and great things start coming to you